Katoa, Morlina, Forestal Kura, um, welcome to Tuesday. Um, a bit of a storm yesterday, so it was good that we um, got through that. Hopefully, the weather's not too bad today, but there is a bit of bad weather in the forecast. Um, I just want to talk a little bit today around uh, my pepiha and the fact that you're all also learning your pepihas. Um, I'm finding this this journey um, looking back into my um ancestors really really rewarding and kind of special so i hope you too are also finding that um so no ko telangi oku tapuna so that means um my ancestors are scottish from the top of uh, great britain there um they're actually the little islands above scotland orkney and, and shetland are where some of my ancestors come from and uh no whanganui uh tara aho um, that is Wellington is where I was born. I'm from Wellington originally, down at the bottom of the North Island. Um, and I grew up in a place called Paraparu Umu, which is a, w a wonderful beachside little town, especially when I was growing up. It was a pretty great place to, to be a kid, to be a primary school kid at. I really enjoyed, I have lots of really fond memories. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna to talk about, I've, I found a few of my ancestors on the ship, the waka that they came over on, and I've got some really interesting little things to show you as well. But I'm really enjoying Pepiha. I hope you are enjoying Pepiha as well. Um, we are slowly designing our school Pepiha as well to help you with that. But let's have a great day of learning, everyone. Ka kiti. Ora koto no mai haia mai ki te FHS TV ko taku enoa ke te ratu te Tua rua te koma toru o potu te rangi e tenera. Hello everyone, welcome to FFH TV. My name is Jared. Today is the 22nd of March. Wasn't yesterday storm crazy? This is a video of Miss Old at some, uh, at some traffic lights. <laughs> The water was up to her doors. Do any of you have stories you can share with your friends? Have a great day. Matewa. Matewa. Five finger breathing technique. Did you know that the skin is the largest organ in your body, made up of lots of nerves, which is why it's so sensitive to touch? Sometimes when you're upset or feeling sad, the sense of touch can be very soothing, like when someone puts their hand on your shoulder or gives you a hug or just gently rubs your back. This technique is a way for you to soothe yourself using your own sense of touch and your breath. But before we begin, have a little think. How are you feeling right now? You'll need two hands for this breathing technique. But let's just start by rubbing gently across the side of your hand to feel what that sense of touch feels like for you. Now in this technique, when our finger moves up, we breathe in, and when it moves down, we breathe out. And you can breathe in and out through your nose, or in through your nose and out through your mouth. Whatever feels more comfortable for you, it's your choice. Let's begin together. Breathing in and out in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Now why don't you try it using your other hand and feel free to close your eyes if you'd like to. Well done. Now have a little think. How are you feeling now? Do you feel the same as you did before or a little bit different? See you next time.
ki a tau iho, ki a tātou katoa. Te rangi Māori e, te manātitanga, me te aroha. Tuturu whakamaua ki a tīna, tīna. Haumie, huie, taiki.